Half centuries from Van Zyl and Rawlins helped Sussex recover. After last week's defeat to Derbyshire ended their promotion bid, Sussex are playing for pride in their final County Championship Division 2 match of the season against Worcestershire at Hove. Worcestershire come into this match on the back of their narrow defeat in the weekend's Vitality Blast final. With an uncontested toss, Worcestershire elected to field first and it looked to be a good decision as they struck with their third ball. Barnard the bowler, Wells out for a duck caught by Cox. And soon Sussex were two down, Haynes gone for a duck as well, Sussex six for two. Van Zyl would steady the ship with some solid strokes to the boundary as Sussex looked to recover from their early wickets. But a third wicket fell soon after, Will Beer the man to go, caught by Cox off the bowling of Barnard. Rawlins would join Van Zyl in the middle and follow his lead as the boundaries came to help rectify the sticky situation for Sussex. The pairing would make it through to lunch with the score 81 for 3, Van Zyl unbeaten on 45 and Rawlins with him on 20. In the afternoon session Van Zyl would move to his half century, a vital knock for Sussex after those early wickets. But he was soon to be the fourth wicket to fall, caught by Rutherford off the bowling of Morris for 56. Rawlins wasn't too far behind in celebrating his own half century. A few overs later, he was also gone though, Finch the bowler to strike as Rawlins was caught by Mitchell for 58 and with that, bad light arrived and T was taken early. And shortly after that, the rain arrived, meaning no more play was possible for the rest of the day. Valuable runs from Rawlins and Van Zyl have helped out Sussex after the loss of early wickets, but more work to do with the bat tomorrow with a score at 150 for 5.